Hello and welcome to this video where I'm going to be showing you how to use ChatGPT to write some podcast scripts. I'm not big on introductions, so let's get right on into it. So in order to help us, I searched for some nice podcast script templates and I came across an article from Buzzsprout. Here's a very simple one uh, where it talks about your message, your jingle. So we have an intro. There's going to be one topic, a main point and supporting points, you know, data and quotes, and it's going to be uh, repetitive overall. So pretty much what we're looking at here first is going to be creating an outline, probably with three main topics and then we can add on more so let's go to chat gpt so it says i need to write a script for a podcast episode about youtube marketing first create an outline about the best marketing youtube tips and i can even add there there are going to be three main points so let's hit enter and see what we get so I said there are three main points and I guess, you know, introduction, optimize and utilize could be three, but there's probably one more that we can use here. Either way, that's fine. You know, you know how to add extras. I'm not going to go through all of them as long as you know how to do this. And this is what I usually do with most of my chat GPT videos. Once you know how to get the process done, like you don't have to have me go through every single section. So now we're going to need an introduction. So give me a second and I'm going to write a prompt for that. All right, so I put, write me a few introduction paragraphs for my podcast called, or podcast episode called The Important, The Important, The Importance, C-E, of YouTube Marketing. I just put my podcast is called Marketing Island. I don't have one, just using it as an example. And in this episode, the three main points that I will discuss are creating your YouTube channel, optimizing your YouTube channel, as well as using YouTube's advertising option. So I just added another one in there when it comes to creating. So we have three main points. Let's hit enter and see what we get. All right, so here we go. Welcome to Marketing Island, the podcast where we dive into the latest and greatest in digital marketing strategies. I'm going to be James. Uh, it talks about how it has 2 billion monthly users. But in this episode, we'll discuss the importance of YouTube marketing and sharing some tips and tricks. I'll start about the basics of creating your channel. Then we'll move on to optimizing your channel. And of course, we'll finally delve into the advertising options. So this is great. This is exactly what we're looking for. We have our little intro with, that's why I put the name of the, you know, you can put your title here. Obviously you can add your name in here. So it's saying, you know, welcome to Marketing Island, gives a little tagline, and then that's gonna be good to go. So I'm gonna copy this and here we go. I just have a uh, Google Doc right here. So let's go back over here. So now that we have that, all we need to do is focus on going through each of the sections. I know I added an extra one in here. So first, we're going to talk about, you know, creating your channel. So give me a sec. I'm going to write a prompt. OK, so I put write a few paragraphs about starting your YouTube channel, talk about the most important aspects of it, as well as why it's more popular than other social media platforms. So if we look at this, our main point, you know, or whatever it's going to be, the importance of starting your YouTube channel, how you can do it. Then, of course, supporting data or a quote or anything like that can be a comparison based upon some other social media outlets. You obviously don't have to use all of these, but we're just going to hit on some of them. So let's hit enter now. Okay, so let's take a look up. I put this for my next prompt down there, but one thing at a time, right? So it talks about the first step when it comes to creating your channel, selecting a username, a banner. Next is creating some professional videos and so on and so forth. And lastly, it talks about how it's popular because of its wide reach and its ability to create and share video content. So I'm going to copy this. This looks good. And I'm going to paste that in. So what if I wanted to add more? Let's say we're going back here and it's like, well, I want some supporting data or maybe a better point. So what I added here was give me some more data and information about why YouTube is so popular for marketing. All right. So we got a lot more that's going to kind of uh, contribute to maybe some data or, you know, specific numbers. Uh, this is one thing with ChatGPT at the time of creating this. It only goes up to 2021. But either way, you can say over 2 billion monthly active users, making it the second largest search engine in the world behind Google, uh, talking about video content, content being shared, targeting options, measurable results, cost effectiveness. So, so this is a good way of backing up what we were talking about. So let's copy that. And just like that, that's going to be one section where we pretty much talk about, you know, the topic, what it was, which was starting your channel, right? Uh, whatever our main point was, that can be up to you, what you want to do, like, you know, spend as little as time as possible. Don't take too long thinking of a name, get your banner done, get it going and start creating your videos as soon as possible. You know, you can create supporting points. We do have data when it comes to that. There were some when it comes to the number of monthly users. And of course, if you have a quote, you know, put something by Abraham Lincoln, call it a day and continue on. Okay. So that's how you would go about these specific aspects of it. So that was just one section. Uh, that would be the second one, right? So we would repeat the process for this and then this. And I'm just going to end on the conclusion so you can see what it's going to look like. Allow me to write a prompt for you. 
All right, so I just put right a conclusion for this podcast episode, summarize the main points, and give additional resources for listeners to continue learning about YouTube. I'm going to be a little bit more specific when it comes to the length, so I'm going to write. All right, so I put right a two-paragraph conclusion. Sometimes you might just get a few sentences, so if I get two or three, that's fine. Let's just do this and roll with it. All right, so there we go. We talked about the importance of YouTube marketing, sharing tips and tricks for optimization, uh, advertising, the basics of it, the importance of appealing in professional videos, benefits, and why it's more popular than other social media platforms. Then it talks about if you want to continue learning, there are some resources available. Keep in mind, you can use this as a template and plug in your own things, or you could just say like, hey, if you want to check out my course, you can do that. Uh, remember to subscribe, share it with a friend, whatever call to action you want to add at the end is going to be completely up to you. I left it pretty bland and broad just so that I can give you more examples of what can go here and talk about it like I'm doing now, but I'm going to copy this. And of course, this is going to be at the end, the conclusion. And as well, don't forget, we did have those other two topics in the middle. But as you can see, we would go through the same process when it comes to writing paragraphs, which we previously talked about. And that should do it when it comes to chat GPT and creating a podcast script. A very big thank you to the uh, Buzzsprout little template here. Very simple template, but from what I've seen in the past, usually the simple templates are what work the best. There's nothing spiffy. There's nothing fancy about this, but it's very easy to plug and play once you have an idea of what you're doing. You're pretty much creating a template based around this. You might have one topic. You might have two, three, four, five, six. And of course, once you have those, you're going to do each section. You have the intros, the paragraphs, the paragraphs, the conclusions, and then you're going to be good to go. So thank you so much for watching this. I hope you got some value out of this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video.